Hello everybody, Yelsa Farmer here. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna test out eggs and wool. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, I've actually had a viewer that were having his map or his farm here at No Man's Land and he struggled with uh, selling his wool. So then I thought, well, that's a challenge since I have my test map here at No Man's Land. So what I've done is I put one ordinary sheep pen here, one ordinary big chicken pen, and on the back side here I have put one of the modded ones that says that when the egg boxes appear here they will appear in a ITA, ITR container and the same one with this one looks like a normal sheep pen but also here it says that in this area a container will pop up and the uh, wool pallets will appear and also I have added some cell points I have of course this one the edge grain vault cell point which literally buys everything I have placed one of the self marketing ones this one will buy my eggs and I placed a cell point here which will take eggs and lastly I put a cell point here which will buy my wool so ah, let's see what happens I have filled up with food and yeah, wheat and food and water to the sheep and now I'm gonna fast forward the time a little bit and I've also bought or at least two ITR, ITR runners I painted the, the one for wool I painted white and the other one I painted yellow for eggs I don't know why but just to divide them a little bit and uh, if you haven't seen these before these are really good I use them all the time these ones you will find under tools and animals scroll over here the ITR why can't I say that today ITR runner container pallets so here you can choose between eggs, milk and wool and you can change the color Whoa. so there you go and then you of course need an IT runner trailer and this one you will find on the trailers bam, bam, bam. over here the ITR 2633 this one also you can change your color to anything you want so that's what you need uh, you could also buy some pallets here uh, because when this area here with egg boxes are full I think this one holds maybe 15 or 20 egg boxes then it's full and you get a notification that you need to empty it but now there are some really good pallets that you can buy let's have a look on those those came out just a couple of days ago I'm usually using these ones the lizard egg pallet which will contain 2400 liter it's 1000 euro to buy but here we have the new ones the reusable egg pallets only 200 to buy and it's 4800 liter so it's double the size of the other one and you can choose tank clear white or tinted so these ones I have bought now at my let's play at La Coronella but I think for this test we'll just 
uh, get the egg boxes, boxes popping up here and then we will drive the ITR okay this trailer we will just drive it alongside and see what happens and the same one with this one for the wool and for the, those two guys back here the ITR container will appear automatically so I'll see you in a bit when uh, they start to produce eggs and wool There we go. The egg container is popping up. No egg boxes inside yet, but I see here on the wool one. Now I had a problem with this one on my former map. That's why I haven't used this because I got the notification when one pallet was full, then I got notification that there was no more room for wool so I think I'm gonna just f keep on fast farming through the night get myself a sleep trigger and see what happens here we see egg box inside already very nice so how are the two normal ones doing one egg box here and here one wool ball so now you see on the in-game sheep pen there are four full pallets now and I got notification that it's full so let's see when I drive this along here if they will load there we go and you need to be a little bit close to them I found out maybe if, oh there we go so there's the sweet spot maybe This one he won't take. I don't know why. <laughs> Strange. Nope. So now I want to test out how. If we just place this one not too close, but maybe here. So let's unload this one and drive it a little bit forward. Maybe it's a little bit cl too close. Here it's also a matter of finding the right spot I think but let's see if we place it there and disconnect it hopefully you can keep it here and the wool pallets will jump into that one this I don't think it's wool anyhow the chickens are doing a little bit slow I tried to fill up with the chickens I got four ones there five there and this one also is still filling up so this one works really much better than last time I tested this so this one will definitely be my choice for my next farm then I only need an ITR runner IT runner. So let's fast forward a little bit more. I think we're gonna do one more day. So this did not work to just leave the container here. I got the notification now that it's full here, but it's only two pallets. 
So maybe that's not a good idea to keep it there. Oh, once you connect to it, it takes some pallets. So, you probably need to keep this a little bit out of the way. And let's try with the egg boxes. Should be the same. Maybe we have to back all the way back to them. Let's try that. No? Okay. Yeah, I think maybe it's all about finding the right spot also for the eggs. So this one Loaded. What if I disconnect it? Hmm. That's strange. Now I need to try the new pallets because this is not working. So I bought myself some reusable egg pallets by Lizard. So these ones should work, at least they are working on my let's play map at La Coronella. And also a cool feature with this one is that they are so light you can pick them up like so. And you can turn them, press L1 and right stick. So let's try to put that down again here. Bam. And in the front, I have the big bag lifter from CS Setback, which can st strap onto more or less everything. So, what should happen now, at least, is that the egg boxes shall and will get into the ballots. If not, there's something wrong with this map. What? Nothing? Okay. So do I have to throw them in? Oh, there we go. Ah, that's... That's just like... That's not good. Why isn't it? That's strange. It's working on my other map, so apparently it got something with the map to do, I think. Let's just leave them there and see. So if this is not working, hmm. well this one is certainly working, so this one is keep filling up, and the one one, whoa, now I got, so there we go, so next step now will be to try to sell the different items I will need I want to have a little bit more eggs so let's wait a little bit longer so I fast forward one more day and this sheep pen here is blowing my mind actually I actually have 
uh, I, in this one I have around 100 let's see the large sheep one is 106 sheep and on the other one I have 134 this one has produced one two three full containers Whew. well this one the in-game one has produced one container and four pallets so one and a half so it's double the amount of wool from this one and it comes finished on the container and this sheep pen is a modded one uh, let's see I can show you where so these are the normal in-game ones, the large and the normal sheep pen whilst the modern ones are these ones they look they look they look the same they look the same there we go uh, but you can see on all the way down on the page a place to keep your sheep the wool produced will be placed on pallets inside a container so there you also got your small all your big ones so let's try to sell some wool that was actually one of the comments I got today that you were not able to sell wool from these ITR pallets or containers so let's first try the edge grain vault we can check the prices Let's see for egg uh, wool. I have the edge grain, I have the vehicle shop grains, and the Wachkausel Gross. That's the self marketing place, and they are always paying good. So let's try the edge grain first, and you should be able to just drive over. There we go. It's going a little bit slow, but the wall is disappearing. So let's try another one. Six thousand. This is a cell point that's actually a part. If you're on this map, especially on no man's land, if you go into silos, because here at no man's land there's nothing more or less when you start so here you have these cell cell points which you can place more or less everywhere and you just need to make sure that on the bottom side of the page it's buying the correct product from you so most of them ha will buy your normal crops but you see this one the bakery will also take egg and milk and this one will only take egg and milk so just be be a little bit uh, cautious there when you choose the right cell point so I'm pretty sure I've chosen the one that will buy my wool let's see nothing try to unload it uh, no nothing Whoa. let's try to disconnect it nothing so this won't work I know there is a cell point up at the shop also I'll try that one there we go yeah this one is taking it and 
then let's try the last one which is the self marketing shop This one, both of these ones are uh, part of a package called self-marketing. Oh. So maybe this one also will buy my wool. No. Well, sold wool for on the seven. Okay. Did he take one? Over here. Disconnected. Seems like one wall disappeared. Or is it one of those that uh, there's no trigger here to So this won't work either. Okay. Now this one is only for soya beans and egg. This won't won't sure. This won't buy it. No. So that's the wool. So the edge grain worked. And the cell point at the shop worked. So will this one, the whole container will disappear when all the wool is sold. It's supposed to do at least. There we go. And then you're ready to pick up the next one. So now let's try to do the same with eggs. So on this one, 4,800 liter. Uh, let's first try also here the edge grain multi buying point or selling point. Let's see what happens here with the eggs. Yeah, you see it down on the right corner, the eggs are going down. Really good. And on this one, the placeable cell point, will this take egg? No. Yeah, the eggs are going down on the bottom right corner. Really good. And then at the self-marketing place or kiosk or whatever, will this one take it? Yeah, there we go. So egg, oh let's keep the last one. There we go. Let's try the cell point on the shop. Yeah. Eggs are disappearing and also the container. Bam, there we go. So, what's my conclusion? Well, it could be uh, something special with the no man's land, especially with 
this one the in-game egg pasture or pen because the IT runner could not pick up the egg boxes but as you see here when I place the new egg pallets the egg boxes uh, appeared inside so what I'm gonna try out now is let's get this on or maybe I should wait I should try the IT runner first of course let's jump in this one and let's see if the egg boxes will jump up now whoa whoop. so let's see no what okay then it's only one thing left to test and that's the this one and Now on La Coronella where I am, I have these pallets, there's a, and there's a chicken pen at my farm there, which is like a built-in chicken pen, so there, and it's really tight, so there I just take the pallets like this, and I drive it to the ITR, and this does not work here or does it no it's taking egg boxes from the <laughs> IT runner what so oh there we go just keep it above okay so that's the way to do eggs maybe So, uh, yeah, I'm very pleased that this one worked. Now, uh, the last time I tested it, it didn't work. Actually, the container uh, was landing halfway on the roofer. So this one, I would recommend. This one also, it works very good. The in-game chicken pens are working. You just have to fiddle around a little bit. You might need these pallets. They are very light, as I said. Also to lift with your uh, tractor and you can throw them around like this. Ah, it's like a cat, always <laughs> ending up the right way. Uh, and this one, the in-game one for sheep, also works pretty good with the animal container autoload so yeah that's that test done thank you for watching and hit that like button if you have any comments please leave a comment or two and subscribe to my channel bye bye